Alright, so this is a video of how to use um, the uh, table of contents in Word, basically to make a table of contents easily. So the first thing you want to make sure you do is that you use the styles that are provided in Word. So the styles are up here. So what we can do first is let's just say we want to do a heading 1 style. And let's say heading 1, let's just put introduction. So heading one is just so we know what that is. So if we wanted uh, a couple different things in our introduction, maybe we wanted uh, introduce the report. And then maybe we want something else there. Um, another heading two. So these are going to be all heading twos. Keep introducing the report. Okay, and then let's say I'm going to go back to a heading one body. And you might have a bunch of different heading twos under there, but let's just keep it simple for now. And then we'll do one more heading three. And we'll put that under. Okay, so now if we insert we have the table of contents by going to references, table of contents, we can insert a couple different types. So I think let's do the first one. So it's going to update the page numbers and whatnot. Now the thing about this is that let's say I like to put the table of contents in the front, so let's move that in the front first. And the thing we want to know is that if we, for example, put things on other, on different pages, let's get rid of this table of contents. Then we have to make sure before we save the file, we update the table of contents because right now it says everything's on page one, which is not. But if we update and then, and we haven't added anything different, so we could do page numbers only. That's how it looks like. And then if we added some more headings, we'd have to update the entire table. So that's a short introduction to making a table of contents in Word.